What is up, little num nums? Numer here, bringing you guys some more seer gameplay. In this gameplay, you will see a three plus cipher kite. I am getting better and better every day with seer. Now you see here that I do spawn at Christmas tree, and that means the hunter spawned at container. And I'm also a seer, so I am communicating with my duo that the hunter is coming towards me, and it is a bloody queen. You see there that that mirror was a little bit off because I pinged right away that the hunter was near me, and Roland the gravekeeper main realized okay let me just get up out of here and listen to the pings rare because randoms actually don't do that however he does have before you in his name so he is expected to do that just like legacy any top teams etc and yes you see me here kiting already i'm gonna immediately take these speed boosts i know that he has his mirror back in time and he's just waiting for it so you see there so i'm gonna start pushing into his main body because that's what you do against a bloody queen i see here i won't make the pallet in time so i end up using my seer owl now, one thing to keep in mind is I was waiting for his mirror to come out and you see there that it is not there. And best case scenario is to not give a free hit. Hunter does an amazing job breaking that pallet right there. However, I know exactly what he's about to do. So I automatically push away and he ends up blinking right there, which is really, really unfortunate because I give a free hit. I only have about 30% of my owl. It's really, really hard to farm owls against the Bloody Queen. You see me do a juke right there. Don't even ask me what happened. I just know the hunter's on me like white on rice, y'all. So it was looking pretty chops, but I did get that one juke, which was really, really fortunate because I was able to last longer. And you can see here that I'm gonna push these two pallets, probably gonna drop immediately because I know that he does not have any blinks. And I'm just gonna wait for his mirror to come up. And from there, I'm just gonna try to farm my owl best as I can, but this hunter knows what I'm doing. He's hiding as best as he can. I thought I could push with this speed boost, but he cut me off. And from here, it's looking pretty chops for me. As you can see there, I tried to do a juke, but it didn't work out. I went left, tried to fake him, and he played me. So you see here that the hunter will pick me up. Three ciphers left, but one of them is about to pop. Actually, two of them. But you will see Roland rotate from Shaq to the Merc Cypher. Merc's going to go for the first rescue. And at this point, remember, guys, I got about 70 to 80% of my owl already. So I should be good to go, you guys. Hopefully it does work out on my favor. We do have a prisoner because Lil Mama was banned. So no mechanic mains from this hunter. However, prisoner is a really good cypher rushing um, character as long as he doesn't kite. Some people can kite with them. Some others can't. You know, it is what it is. It just be like that sometimes. Now you see here that the Merc is trying to bait out his mirror. But he sees that the hunter is not going for it. Gets that rescue right before half. You see me farming up my owl. I see that he does mirror and I end up making this pallet in time. And as soon as I see the hunter use his ability where he can rotate the hunter, not the hunter, the mirror, you guys, you know what I mean. Stop playing with me. When he can rotate the mirror towards me, I immediately back away because I know he's either going to swing right away or he's just going to push the mirror towards me and smack me down. I see that the hunter does switch mirrors. And right now I'm just trying to farm my owl as best as I can. I know I'm so close to it. Hopefully I can get to this pallet in time. Boom, he swings too early. I get to it in time. And of course he mirrors, look, look, 100. And then I get smacked. Like I probably could have got my owl in time, but you know, like I said, y'all, sometimes it just be like that. But it is looking pretty good for us. We've got about two ciphers left, about to be one, and it will be prime soon. So now I just need the gravekeeper to rescue. And from there, we noticed that the hunter will have blink soon, about 10 seconds left on it. So we gotta also keep that in mind, you guys. And the Gravekeeper does have wanted, which is really, really unfortunate. But you see here that the Hunter will wait. And they're going to go for the double rescue since the Cypher is primed. Or at least close to it, as you can see there. So Gravekeeper is going to use his Tide. Boom, gets smacked right now. No? Okay, never mind. Maybe I don't even know my own gameplay. He does get smacked right there, y'all. Chill out on me. And he ends up getting that free rescue, which is really, really clutch. And he actually switches targets to smack the Mercenary, but ends up not hitting him. Right here, you can see he does get that swing, and we're going to say focus on the coating. Boom, it gets popped, and you're going to see here that the Bloody Queen will waste his mirror on top of me, and boom. I already got my owl. It's too late for all that. I didn't know what the hunter was doing at first, so I just waited to give callouts to which gate to go to. And I'm like, okay, okay, he's committed to you. He's like, no, he's committed to the Gravekeeper at uh, Moongate. So I'm like, okay, okay, let's all push Christmas Tree. You see here, Roland's going to do his best job to last as long as he can. Do an amazing amazing job, amazing dodge. You know, he's, you see the S tier access or the A tier access for you guys. I still haven't got nothing from the um, Essence. I don't know why they do me dirty for the daily ranked ones. And I play it every day. But you see here that the Mercenary did open the gate in time and elbow padded right away. 
he switches to teleport. I know a lot's happening right now, y'all. You see that he will mirror and insta down the prisoner, even with the stun. And from here, we all will push Moongate. And it will be a GG's. Good three man on our part. Other than that, hopefully you all did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and just stay a while. You will see that I do post daily content and I try to live stream as best as I can. And yeah, you see the little roll into his little dancey dancey. And remember guys, I'm Numer and I'm out.